Hello everyone, time to grind here, and today we're playing some more uh, Peglin. Um, we're still uh, in our Halloween outfit, obviously, um, and uh, from last episode uh, where we played Spinventor, right? Uh, the episode before that we had won uh, Crucible 13 with Roundrel, uh, and so we're just, all we gotta do is beat uh, Crucible 13 on Spinventor before we go to Crucible 14 on all the characters here. Last episode, we made it in the castle. We did some really cool upgrading builds. Uh, nothing that uh, won. And so we're going to try again. Remember, I don't know if this is utilizing uh, Haglin too early, but if you remembered last episode, we won with Roundrel. It was because we asked for Voidlin Haglin's blessing. And we're going to do the same thing here, right? We're going to, we're going to, I know, I know it's early. We only had three losses last episode, but uh, Haglin, Voidlin, um, could you, could you bless? Could you bless this uh, Spinventor run? Okay, I appreciate it. Thank you. There's a lucky charm. We gotta see. We gotta see how useful this lucky charm is. Uh, immediately getting offered cookie. I mean, that's a that's a solid way to start a uh, a run here. Honestly. Um. So yeah, that's what we're trying to do here. Can't stress this enough. Headband is a great look on you. I might. I might. I might dabble in in, in trying to do it more. And we're gonna. We talked about it last episode, but uh, <laughs> stealing cans of loans. <laughs> Uh, look, no, it's just, uh, it's, it's kind of helpful early on. Like I didn't like, it's like, it's a replacement for having to use a bunch of hair gel, but this was the, this was a $3 headband from target. They had no others. Actually, it came with an American flag one, but, um, I did not think an American flag, uh, headband would be, uh, very fitting with, with, uh, a Ken. Cause this is obviously a Ken Halloween outfit, Halloween outfit, low effort Halloween effort, uh, out, out. Out the whatever. Um, okay. So do we have we have enough gold here? So let me just go ahead and get this bomb. So yeah, the fact that we have cookie, obviously, last couple episodes we've been struggling. Particularly last episode, um, our refresh situation was was not great. Um, and so especially since we have cookie, very much want to try to, you know, get something pretty good here. Um, okay, so replenish orb. That is a refresh thing, right? Um, yeah, yeah. That would that would very much help our refresh situation. Oh, wow. Two chests in a row. Void Voidlin Haglin, I think, blessed us here pretty well. Let's I don't this is this is pretty promising here. Uh Strange Brew. So all those refreshes all actually contribute to damage is pretty decent. Maybe we do duplication potion build. Uh bombs do more damage, so we've almost unnerfed them. Um, and then I think we just stay on the right side of the map here to be honest i i, I can i was gonna try to for those bombs it did not work i am uh, fine with that um okay so yeah replenish orb actually dealing damage here too right so it refreshes when fired immediately and every eight hit is adding more refreshes which is very good because we have cookie so that is a lot of healing and a lot of refreshes uh, that we have just now officially solved right our bombs do more damage which is nice obviously um we probably should see who we're fighting right now we are fighting the mole last uh couple times we've been to the boss it has been the slime so um, I think mole will be good. The bomb's doing a little bit more damage is good. Definitely want to try to find some AOE, uh, to prepare both for the castle and, um, you know, the, the boss as well. Early cookie is nice. Always feels good seeing that at high crucibles. Yeah. The cookie, cookie is S tier, uh, S, S tier, uh, relic for sure. Um, especially, yeah, starting out unbelievably good. Also. It felt like we just put a refresh on top of the crit. I don't I don't really know if that did what I thought it did there, but okay, I'm even going to take reorganizer here. So we have every part oh, I'm tempted on the laser, but I'm going to take reorganizer because we officially have all the parts of the duplication potion combo besides duplication potion. Right? We have strange brew, we have reorganizer. So if we can actually find um duplication potion we're off to the races um we're not gonna get a shop at all because we decided to go to the left which is fine um hurts our chances of finding duplication potion but maybe we find it in caves or something like that at the very least we're doing this is pretty good yeah if we found refreshing punch there's there's a lot that we could do here even with the reorganizer right reorganizer does a decent amount of damage too and um hopefully we'll stay very very healthy um, we don't really have, I mean, Reorganizer does damage. Maybe I should have done the laser 
for some consistent raw damage, but I don't know. The the biggest damage we're going to need is some sort of AoE uh, or um, something. I'm very happy the bombs do more damage, though. That's helping out a lot. And I don't really care where we go. Probably just right. I want to make sure we get a bunch of gold here, though. Hopefully. Luckily, I mean, we really shouldn't have to be buying healing at all, you know. Okay. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. 139 on a guy that had 10 HP. So yeah, I mean, Reorganize is a 3-7, level 1. I believe upgrading it gets it more damage, too, so... Um... Kinda want Jack or Blanern. You know what, I will. <sighs> yeah, because it can target any enemy that's good for this boss. It's good for Spin Venter. Um, and let's try to get a little bit more gold here. We got like one more gold. Um, but it'll trigger a lot of refreshes for Cookie. It'll do good damage. It can target the boss that we're trying to target. So I think I think that's a very good pick uh, for right now. Okay. Apparently there's a Peglin Relic tier list on Tier Maker now. Didn't realize how big the Peglin community got. Is it actually up to date? Because I've seen some of those in the past that are just like pulling from the wiki and the wiki's not really up to date. At least last one, last I've checked, so. Man, dude, this cookie. Dude, I'm telling you, is if, if this is actually the play, if we have bought a very nice plush that will... Um, which shout out, right? Not obviously not a sponsorship. I paid my own hard earned money. I did not get this for free. Both for this, I have the I have the the, the other Peglin, I have the keychain plush. Makeship is a good company. I know I bought an upgun one at some point in time. Because like I want to support the devs as well, you know. Um, so I think my upgun one should be here soon. I just love honestly the the, the makeship company, right? Just partnering with other indie devs to do kind of like little Kickstarter plush project things is 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 a fantastic way for indie devs that have a, a little bit of a um, community to uh, to make money right I'd love I'd love for our channel to get big enough where we get some some uh, maybe we turn uh, munch our Dino little mascot into a plush or something or I know there's that company U2s that does a bunch of content creator figureheads. Um, okay. Uh, yeah, we can just upgrade. I'm gonna upgrade Jack or Blanner because I really just need some damage to actually be able to fight the boss, you know. I have arrived. You don't know me, but this is gonna be the run. I believe. I believe this is gonna be the run. This run has been blessed, and I'm ready for it. Love to have a munch plush. Yeah, I'm so excited um, in November. We're gonna have some new permanent merch. Not not knowing none of this limited shenanigan stuff. Some dope munch merch, so. <gasps> Stay tuned. Okay, uh, that was pretty good. Um, I think we just upgrade. We killed that really fast. So we'll do Jack or Blanner. <gasps> um. I want the gold on the left, but I want to right kind of is a little bit more consistent here. So for what we're trying to do, uh, whenever the board's refreshed, you'll damage the target enemy equal to the number of pegs restored. That's pretty good. I will say that's pretty good with the amount of refreshes that we have. This is one of those builds that it's like, if it offered us the leaf, the refresh leaf, would we take it? That's the question. I think honestly, I. In order to guarantee that you're not going to throw, I really think it's like you need both cookie and like, um, not even refill buster, but like the uh, refresher course or whatever it's called. The one where every four refreshes, you buff up your damage. You need some way to actually get some damage from all of that. I think is the big thing, man. I hope we get duplication potion. Dude, it has been forever since we've had a successful duplication potion build. So a duplication potion build would be great. Yeah, broccoli, broccoli would be good. I think you need something to make the leaf work. Fuck the leaf. I definitely understand why there's that sentiment, right? But we've we've made it work before. If you guys hadn't seen, um, there was like a video called like OP refresh leaf build or something. It was like the 
I, that, that thumbnail was really fun for me to make. The one where the round rolls like surfing on the, the leaf or whatever. But um, okay, now we're gonna upgrade. Yeah, let's just upgrade what we have, right? Um, well, yeah, let's just upgrade reorganizer. That's more damage. I feel like we just need our damage to go up. You know what I mean? Um, want to go to the right here? I want to fight that elite. I don't trust the leaf one bit. <laughs> Okay, so reorganizer here. It's just effectively there for damage now at this point. 76. Miss. Good amount of damage there. Uh, before we hit all those other bombs, I'm going to try to just generate money. Money, 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 money. Money, 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 money. If you have enhanced gunpowder, getting money on this map is so easy. It's also so easy to like... Just kill everyone instantly, which sometimes doesn't get you as much money, but... Man, Jack or Blanern is so good on this Spinventor. So good. Um, okay. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead, just keep upgrading. We don't need to heal anything, so upgrade Reorganizer to become a 511. Try to get a little bit more gold. Like, five more gold. That's good. That's good. Um, two, four. Yeah, I guess we just replenish orb here. Get the crit. It's gonna do a little bit of damage here. Should be pretty easy to hit the refresh. Yeah, we'll just uh, jack or blander probably. Probably gonna. Oh, it went on the left. No, if it went on the ins. Okay, okay, okay. That's fine. One oh eight. One oh eight damage. That's pretty good. Um, I think this is fine. No, it wasn't fine. Rip. This will be fine. This is a lot of damage. This is a lot of damage. I think we just kill here. Yeah. Easy. Didn't even take any damage to this guy. Okay. I don't know, man. Maybe we our build actually got blessed. Now we have a restore. Okay. Bombs apply blind or enemy damage. Okay. Let's I'm going to take ax me anything because that actually helps in the castle, right? The shields. So instead of them taking half damage on their shields, they take double damage on their shields. I love the buff that ax me anything got a long time ago. I guess we're taking nine damage here before this boss here. Uh, but I think I think this is good. I think this is good. This is, this is a pretty sick, pretty sick build here going on. I imagine we should be able to beat the mole boss here. We have plenty of healing. Uh, with Cookie and the, the refresh shenanigans we got going on. Bombs do a little bit more damage. Okay. Yeah, this should do a lot. Still got one more time here, I think. Yeah, already 164 plus the 45 bomb damage. Pretty good. Um, surprisingly, didn't hit the crit there. I was thinking it was going to hit the crit. We added a couple refreshes. That's fine. Constant healing. Love to see it. Come on, get that bomb. Get that bomb. Yes! Both projectile guys are dead. We used Restore. So, yeah, we're going to be able to actually start generating max HP next wave. Um, I think the Axe Me Anything. We still need more AoE, but the Axe Me Anything will get us... Uh, will make it a little bit easier on us to, to get through the shields and stuff like that. We won't be screwed as bad. But we still desperately need AoE, right? Love Axe and Castle. Yeah. Honestly, we don't get offered it a lot before castle, or at least that maybe don't notice it. Oh yeah, it refreshes the board when fired. Forgot about it. That's why it altered the bounce that one time. Okay, I mean we're still taking a little bit more damage than I originally thought we were gonna take, but uh, that's fine. honestly fine. Cause you still heal fifty percent, I think. Oh yeah, we have a filibuster too. Every time I refresh, I've been hurting him. I didn't even notice that. Nice. And then this gets to a hit him in particular. Oh, let's go. Let's go. We may kill. I think we kill here. Nah. Oh, we kill. <laughs> As we're 100% health into castle. We get this to work here. We could get this to work. Um, assemble. If it was the AOE assemble, I would take it. Um, no, I'll still take it. In case we find other parts of the assemble. So we're going to upgrade restore. Nice. Okay. Gift. Less discards, which I don't think I want that. Yeah, we'll just go gift. Gift shall be good. In Axe we trust. Okay. So there is a shop on the right. Dude, I just... This is... I hope... I hope... <laughs> 
I hope we just have a a good. A, I mean, gift here was really good, so we love everything about this run. I know, which is exactly when we beat with the uh, Crucible 13 with the round roll. Uh, what two episodes ago? It was because we were blessed by Haglin Plushy, and uh, it gave us everything we needed in the first run of that video. And if it does it again here, we need to not abuse it, right? We really need to only ask for blessings when we've been struggling for a while. But um, once again, no sponsor. But uh, shout out uh, if you want a good luck charm. Go uh, next time they have a campaign. <laughs> Give give Red Nexus your money. I don't, I don't get a cut out of it. I would love to get a cut, <laughs> but I, I'm just for real, for real. Buy your lucky charm. Okay. Um, refresh over there. Yeah, and I think Axe Many thing is gonna be really good. Let's fucking hear that. I'm telling y'all. Anyone with a loud ass car like that has, if they are a male. Small peepee. -pee. It's just the way it is. I don't make the rules. I don't know. I don't make the rules. But if you have an unnecessarily loud car, 99% of the chance, okay, you're like a big buff dude. The little wee wee. That's like how it works. Not me to take a screenshot. I don't make the rules. It's just how how it be. That's just that's just how it be. <sighs> okay, um, shock absorber, no, okay, we probably upgrade replenish orb now, actually, no, honestly, you know what, let's, let's, let's take this money to the shop, let me buy a duplication potion, let me go, so what do you, what if you don't have a car, do you have a large PP, <laughs> uh, you might, um, ambidextionary is looking pretty tasty here. Honestly, probably over the refresh. Yeah, ambidextion or uh, removing. So yeah, that helps us get rid of uh, so many of the the bad orbs. Hey, get rid of a pebble. That's good. Want the chest? Bike gang represent. I mean, I feel like bikes. <sighs> I don't know. I guess like, cause bikes are, are that they're allowed to be a little bit louder in my opinion, but there's still, there's still a point where you've made your bike unnecessarily loud and the same rule applies, but there, there, there is, there is a slightly different tolerance because bikes inherently are a little bit louder. So, you know, the, the, we're, we're fair about it. The scale does change a little bit, but, um, that's why you, we use the, the, the specifically unnecessarily loud, you know? So, once again, I don't, I don't make the rules. Also, if I had hit that crit correctly earlier, it wouldn't have taken all that damage. But I think it's fine. Got a bunch of refreshes. Should be fine here. And, uh, yeah, I'll jack a planet. So we're really hoping that we find the assemble piece uh, for hitting all enemies. That's what we're looking for here. Seven forty four. Man, yeah, and I—I uh, I don't know why I've been—I've been dealing with. Uh, if you guys saw, I think like two videos ago, the Peglin video um, that had the World of Warship sponsorship. It's just some stupid shenanigan, uh, shenanigans been going down between uh, um, the site I used to to get that sponsorship and they pretty much like because the website was like not really playing nice with it was like they forced you to post the video on listed so they could approve it which is fine but then the the, the the website was having a hard time discovering unlisted videos so I'm having to like do all these workarounds and then uh, long story short the sponsor I don't I don't even think it was world of warships fault I think it was like they accepted it and then the the website just glitched and acted like the video didn't have the sponsorship and uh they're just like yeah no you, you don't get the money i was like okay let me contact like support let me let, let me get this resolved like oh yeah unfortunately we can't do anything we can't help you excuse me what and luckily like i've been uh fortunate enough to get some other bigger sponsorships uh just through my email and and stuff like that um but i'm like man if this is gonna if this is this, this, this how y'all gonna treat content creators here at lurk it then <laughs> 
just stop using you, but just weird stuff, weird, weird behind the the, the heat, this scene stuff. Because it's been very nice. I'm sure you guys have seen, um, you know, some some uh, ads or sponsorships every now and then, and the, the Peglin and Crab Champions, which is helping a lot, getting us closer to full time content creator. But it's just like silly. You still have to deal with stuff like that, you know. Bikes are louder, but even most basic bike is much louder than any car, especially lower powered ones. Those are annoying as fuck. Yeah. They, they definitely are still a little bit louder. I, I still give them a little bit of leeway just because, you know, they, they do happen to, but like, it's very obvious when it's like an unnecessarily loud, you know, thing. Um, okay. Yeah, being able to discard twice is kind of nice. And man, even though we're healing a lot, I feel like we're still struggling because we don't really have any AoE yet. Like, we're still really struggling on that that part. Like, I, man, we need Prime Rod of Frost or... Freaking... Uh, Overwhammer. Some actual AoE stuff. Remember when you did the insane Matryoshka build? We've done some insane. We've done Matryoshka builds a couple times. Um, I think I know which time to time out, but I'm, we've done it a lot, so I don't hard to remember the exact one you're talking. Also, very much want duplication potion. I'm still gonna upgrade. Honestly, I don't think we need uh, so many fucking loud cars. I think it doesn't help that I'm in like um, trying to. I'm on a street that uh, people sometimes use for racing. So also I'm gonna I'm gonna be a professional streamer here. I have to like adjust my green screen settings when I wear this hoodie. Because obviously it says it doesn't have green, but it has somewhat green. Sometimes messes with the the thing here. Oh, what was that? At least we're getting max, uh, max HP from it. So that's nice. Um, some point in time, we'll probably want to upgrade Splat Orb. I know we always kind of neglect the starting orbs more than we really should sometimes, but... <sighs> um, still taking a lot of damage here. Pumpkin Pie, can you save me? Can you save me, Pumpkin Pie? I'm targeting the wrong person. Of course I am. Targeting someone that has... Well, did I hit a bomb? If I hit a bomb, we should be fine. Because the target will just automatically change. Oh, nice. Because we had Refillabuster, the target changed anyways. Because, yeah, remember, every time we refresh, we're dealing damage to the person that we're targeting. So, I, that that's the only reason we're somewhat still, like, okay with... Uh, um, not having as much AoE as we should. Okay, heal, heal me up a bunch. Get a bunch of refreshes so I can cook you a bunch. Okay. Also, another uh, behind the scenes thing, obviously, because we've been talking about it a lot. Uh, for those of you guys just tuning in or um, how, if you're watching this on YouTube, just kind of an interesting thing we've been thinking about. Because obviously, I'm sure you've heard myself and every content creator talk about how uh, multi-streaming, that's what we can do now. Like, it's insane. Like, we have 56 people watching me live, which I know compared to other big streamers, that is nothing, right? But, like, just to, like, overnight, like, have, like, kind of doubled my viewers is kind of insane. I know, like, some of that overlap is some people being in both chats or whatever. Um, but kind of insane, but we're experimenting with, um, you know, trying to keep maybe the live streams up on YouTube and still do the same thing, right? Where we have the YouTube videos all nice and edited and added to playlists. Um, but yeah, let me know your opinions on that. I'm just always like, I'm scared that it's going to like hurt the actual videos. So we are doing kind of an experiment with them, you know, like, I don't know if people are going to like watch the Peglin videos less because... You know, I really don't know how it works, but I don't think anyone does. That's why all, all us content creators are like trying to figure out what the, the best way to do things is, you know? So, you're rocking the mustache and beard. <laughs> yeah, we're seeing what grows out. Um, Appreciate it. 
Uh, when applying Brain Ball to an enemy, apply Blind to. So we're not Spin Venters, so that's actually not that great, unfortunately. <sighs> because we won't just constantly apply either Blind or Brain Ball. So if we find something that could let us apply Blind or Brain Ball, maybe we take it because now we have that. But man, I just want Duplication Potion. That's what I want. It's called Game in the System. <laughs> Yeah, we're just trying to see what helps us grow the channel the most. Because, man, dude, I'm I'm really feel. I guess I've, I've probably been saying this for like a year. But it truly does feel like we're getting close to being able to do this full time. Really does. I'm telling y'all, that's all I've ever wanted. Growing up as a kid, probably just because I watched too much freaking YouTube growing up. Man, I was such a... Oh, dude, watching Smosh, Angry Video Game Nerd, JonTron, Peanut Butter Gamer, um, Angry Video, or I already said that, uh, Angry Joe Show, uh, Total Biscuit, to when Total Biscuit died, man, that was sad, um, well, I guess it's sad when anyone dies, that's supp supposedly how that is, but at least just the way it was with Total Biscuit, if you guys didn't know, he just got a very aggressive form of cancer that people don't normally get till they're really, really old. And just, uh, he was trying to fight through it as hard as he could. And just trying to, he was trying to, you know, make as much money to leave his wife as he could when he died. And, uh, man, it was just, I remember when it happened. Like, I mean, because he, he, if you guys don't know who he, who he was, he was probably one of the most influential, like, definitely up there, like, uh, like, gaming, like, critics. I don't want to say, like, critics, but, like, he, he reviewed games, did first impressions. He had a series called, like, WTF is insert game here um and i mean th there's like entire communities like the warframe devs if, if you guys know warframe warframe would probably not exist right now if it was if it wasn't for total biscuit like they've single-handedly like said that they were struggling like and he finally covered their game at one point in time and like just reviewed it so well to his massive audience that that in itself like kind of revived warframe and like I don't know, like, kept it alive, right, and made it popular, um, and, I mean, that goes for a lot of content creators, you know, covering a lot of different games, but it's just, he, he was big into the esports scenes of a lot of games, like StarCraft and stuff, and so, uh, I remember watching a lot of gaming tournaments, you know, it was like stereotypical, like, moment of silence type stuff, um, but, that is the way it go, I suppose. Like you just gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta have, you gotta have a fun time while you're here. Try to, try to leave a, leave a good impression. Leave the universe with some good vibes. That's all you can do, right? Um, so assemble. Let's upgrade that. That's what we wanted. So now we finally have something hitting everybody, and we're fighting the wall. I am a little bit scared about that, but we'll do what we can here. We'll do what we can. Rip techno blade. Yeah, he was someone I, I didn't watch too much. Uh, or at all. I, uh, I kind of just didn't know he existed, but I know a lot, he impacted a lot of people. So it is sad when when that kind of stuff happens. <sighs> okay, so we're fighting mini wall right before wall. So we hit a good crit. So <laughs> good start here already. Thousand damage. 1500 damage to begin with. Wow. Having two discards is really nice. We got the AoE. Wow, we're gonna kill him in two hits. Okay, this is keeping me pretty confident for the wall fight. It's keeping me pretty confident. Um, I do think I'll take Bramble now. Um, because it'll apply blind as well, but that's actually not that much. Going the other way around is decent. When applying Bram, what, we'll just apply two, is that even worth it? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'll take it. And we'll upgrade it one time. It's good damage here. Ooh! Ooh! Every three times the board's refresh, gain a muster coal. so we're doing non-crit stuff here. Duplication station's really good as well, but broccoli, obviously, we said was one of the good things that are with refresh. So, we'll definitely take that. Still have a chance to find Duplication Potion, right? This still has a chance to be a Duplication Potion. Even if it's not, um, that is a huge spike. We're going to have a lot more damage. We just don't want crits anymore. So, now we want um, to get Unpretentious Pendant. That's what we want now. Uh, this hits all enemies and actually does more damage when... Uh, 
non-crit. And also, yeah, we have Gift. Gift on this map is really good. I love that we just call it Broccoli instead of the actual name. I mean, yeah, who's gonna say Brassicakia Knuckles? <laughs> like, what the fuck? I, th it's some of the puns in this game. Um, you know, you have really good puns, like some of the orbs, like Restore, Pebble, Replenish Orb. You have Brassicakia Knuckles. I probably just don't know the pun of what that's supposed to be talking about, but. Broccoli, boob broccoli. Oh man, we were close to that crit. I think I think we'll be okay here. Hopefully. So all these refreshes here, giving us more non-crit damage. Once we trigger them. Okay. Pumpkin pie! So we're hoping this does just a crap ton of damage. Yeah, we're hoping for unpretentious pendant. That's what we're hoping for. Call it Busty Broccoli. That's a good name, too. It's a, uh, a thick, curvy piece of broccoli for sure. Dude, Jack or Blanard Man on Spin is crazy. So we have three muster coal. So it's actually good that this is non-crit. Wow, dude. We're already at 2,000 damage. It's gonna be even more. Oh, it was 1,700? Huh, okay. Okay. Whatever you say. Oh, come on, hit a refresh. No! Okay, we're half, I think we're doing good though. I'll throw this. Cause just hitting those refreshes are worth it. Right, increasing the, uh, the stats here. Brassicakia is the family of plants that includes broccoli. Oh. More like busted broccoli. <laughs> it's really good. I it definitely can get busted for sure. So this doesn't actually matter whether it was crit or not. So 600 damage. Being able to discard twice is huge. Oh, I shouldn't have gone for the crit. I don't know why I went for that. It's way less damage on a crit. Oh man, we didn't even get that refresh either. Kind of rough. I think we're fine, but... Yeah, free refreshes, baby! Gift is sometimes making us waste the refreshes. It hasn't this time, but like, see it... it okay, it didn't waste any of those there. Sometimes it does. So we don't want this to hit the crit. We're gonna have a lot more non-crit damage, but there's a crit right here, so I don't know. Pumpkin pie, there's a good chance it'll hit it. Hopefully it doesn't. Yeah, 1500 damage. Honestly, yeah. I think we're good. This I this may kill. Because I but yeah, this kills. I'm 90% sure here. Because our damage is gonna go up once it actually triggers. Like it's gonna bump up. The, oh yeah. Yeah, we're easy peasy. Easy peasy, baby. Okay, um, we're going to upgrade Bramble. Okay. So, no unpretentious pendant. There's glorious suffering. Man, I knew it was going to offer us wand. So I was like thinking of sp spending all my money. I don't... Man, do we take the upgrade thing? Yeah, actually, this is one of the few times I think we could take the upgrade thing. Because we have a lot of damage, unfortunately, not on Jack or Blandern, but a lot of these things... I don't know. I'm gonna take it. I think we can take it. There was nothing else good. Uh, we have plenty of refreshes this time. We're fighting the dragon. So having more scaling is not bad. I'm um, just a little bit worried sometimes. But we can discard a lot, which will help. And gift. Oh yeah, gift with this too actually is big, so. I think we could do something here. think we could do something here. Okay, um, Restore, right? We're constantly increasing our max HP here with Restore, which is really helpful. Uh, we're gonna take a bunch. No, 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 we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're fine. Yo, yo, Defcon. Everyone else tuning in. Uh, Ball Lightning could be okay, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna save up, try to get as much gold as I can here. Save up for the shop. We want to go to the right here. Um, special relic. 
We do have gift that would help us. Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Kind of risky. Infernal ingot. We can still keep increasing our max HP. Oh, y yikes. No shot for us. I fucked that up. I even tried to slow the... Slow it down. Um, and not much we can upgrade, so we'll take the special uh, perfect forger here. So. Uh, yeah, we have 57 HP. But with gift, right, it should be pretty good. A um, lot of consistent healing and stuff like that, you know? Uh, okay. Yeah, we should be good. That should be fine. Plus a little bit more consistent damage to people, but not a lot. It's not like anything that really matters. So we're just hoping to get the, uh, the refreshes. Still more refresh stuff. Like, because we do have a lot of orbs. That's why I'm not trying to take too many more orbs, right? At least we have the, uh, the discard thing. So this is what's huge, right? Once we can actually get the replenish orb out. A lot of damage. And see, that's the thing. Now restorb even matters a lot more. When you after you take the infernal ingot, any max HP gain you get after taking infernal ingot is is just huge. Huge, huge, huge. Man, I think. I think, I think Roundrel, Voidlin, whatever. I think, uh... I think we got our, our run blessed, for sure. I mean, don't want to count my chickens before it hatches. Probably should have done this a while ago, right? But, uh, obvious. We could, we could, we could, we could time to grind guarantee seal of approval here. I feel like that's a, it's a pretty decent time for that, right? These, these glasses are still insanely hard to... To see through <laughs> so no no early shop unfortunately we could we probably want to go far right go to that shop on the right <sighs> okay so skip skip um red bombs could be a little bit scary here i hope we don't trigger them all Jack of Blanner is gonna be pretty good here. Just hopefully, it doesn't accidentally trigger a bunch of red uh, trigger a bunch of red bombs. Hoping this will at least kill that front guy. I don't think it is going to though. But it's upgrading a lot of stuff, so that's fine. And then we get the oh, I didn't realize he buffs everyone that's alive. I didn't realize that. Did not actually realize that. Man, I wish we had some freaking AOE. I wish we had some AOE. Upgrading, especially this left side of the map, quite a lot. Glorious Suffering and Gift is wonderful. If we had AoE, this would be finished so much faster. TTG is my spirit animal. <laughs> Excuse me. I don't know how to feel about that. Okay, we're gonna get suicide bombed. Wow. Wow, dude! Are we dead? Mm -hmm. Oh boy. <sighs> we lost. The the blessing I guess the blessing doesn't work when we take Infernal Ingot. Dude, I, it's the TTG guarantee. The second I TTG guarantee, it's all over. The second I TTG guarantee, it's all over, man. I'm telling y'all. I'm telling y'all, I know how this shit works. The devs, the devs are watching. Devs are 100% watching. Not really, but like, oh man, that's rough. That's rough. Um, cause that was, that was a really cool refresh build and it just didn't work out. Okay. We'll try one more time here. Um, I don't know how do these sand arrows, I'm, I'm sick of the upgrading stuff here. Once again, though, we took glorious suffering and we got screwed. Maybe it's because we took glorious suffering. 
We just didn't have piercing, the suicide bomb, we lost all our health. I don't know. I'm trying to think like what I should have done differently, right? Like, should I have not taken the infernal ingot? I thought I would have had plenty of healing. We had the restore to keep increasing our HP. Just, just an F. It's just a big old F. A big old F there. A big old F. Why'd the bomber do 46 damage though? Did he do 46? I don't think he did that much. So we, we had like what, 50 something? 59 HP? We got Brown to like, maybe that is 40. I don't know. I don't think it was that much damage. Or oh, wait, is suicide bomb damage increased on that buff? Because remember, we noticed that he was buffing the friends. Right? You can skip a boss relic if you want after castle. I know. I just always feel so bad skipping relics. And I, I, Glorious Suffering felt like it made sense there. Slendy Boy buffs the bombers, I'd assume. Yeah. You got fucked there, man. You got absolutely destroyed. Okay, hit the refresh. Hey, it's what I wanted to see. Kill the front guy. That was awful. That was on me there. Um, what boss are we fighting? Ah, damn slime. Okay. Fighting the slime. The blind doesn't help fully. Okay. Can I not take a billion damage here? Because now I'm just sad that we... Ah. Ah. Okay. Um, I'm just going to save my money here one time. Didn't see anything I really wanted there. I think the ingot wasn't the play. Yeah, I thought it would, it would be fine because we had restore, but we did lose a lot of what we had gained. So I guess it probably is a little bit risky to do because of the red bombs and suicide bombers there. We've, we've had runs just evaporated, right? If we had more of a health pool to deal with. Just got bombed too soon after tank taking the ingot. Yeah. I can't wait for the, the seven YouTube comments that are like, you should have aimed, at, you should have brought your protractor out and angled at a different angle while also ignoring Twitch chat. I don't know why. I don't know why I've, I've I've let some of the previous comments get so to me. I don't I don't I don't think they've gotten fully to me. It's just I can't help but constantly think about every time something happens. I'm like, okay, yeah. There's there's going to be people that are just they're just they're just angry. They're just they're just angry individuals. But <laughs> it's okay. We just got we got we got we get the win here. Took a lot of damage there. A lot of damage there. I have a lot of gold. Um, okay, that one was on me. See, there's sometimes, sometimes I know for sure, right? Like that was a bad throw. Seventeen. Okay, there we go. Seventy-four. It's not too bad. Um, crits below. Trigger or crit every six hit. I don't know, dude. And bomb, bomb always seems just not worth it either. Um. Just upgrade Splatorb one time. I really don't know. want to buy any of these things yet. Right. Definitely going hunting for rude comments. No, I gotta, I gotta learn. I gotta learn. I gotta go. I gotta learn for myself. Don't, don't, uh, I genuinely don't want to, uh, you know, have those removed before I see them, you know, unless they're extremely like things that we would like not allow in the Twitch chat, you know? I've heard it's even worse. Apparently, uh, Northern Lion um, stopped playing Backpack Hero uh, because the back seating was too hard. And I, in in the two or three Backpack Hero videos I filmed, I definitely felt that because that's just the style of game where people uh, just really like they're like, oh my god, if you had just adjusted your sword, because if you guys know what Backpack Hero is, you could definitely. You can definitely see how that type of game would lead to some of the most backseat gaming on the planet, you know. You sure TTG? Yeah, 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 for real. I, I genuinely want to, uh, I genuinely don't think I want, uh, comments, uh, 
you know, sanitized for me or anything. Twitch chat is a little bit different. Not that I want to sanitize, but there's more of a purpose there for me, but yeah. Because YouTube all, also already, like, YouTube, that, that's a, another reason is YouTube is already so gung-ho. Like, there's there's a tab where it'll, it'll take comments that it thinks it should remove and remove them. So, like, once a week I have to, like, go to YouTube's thing called, like, hold, held for review. And half the time it's perfectly normal comments that, like, YouTube decided I shouldn't see. So that's why I'm also just like, so like, yeah, I really want to make sure I can actually see all the comments, you know, and I guess we're just going to upgrade Splatorb. Maybe we, we take that. We, we learn Maybe we should be doing that more. Um, I still, I don't know. Could get some gold. I just don't want to go in the fire here a little bit though. Super auto pets is pretty bad too, but it's easy enough to call people dumb. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to remember. We did a lot of super auto pets. Um, um, videos back in the day. I, I remember getting some, but I feel like from what I remember, those comments were more in the constructive criticism category. Like, yo, I just had this crazy build with hippos. You know, you seem to kind of ignore hippos. You should definitely try out hippos in the future, you know? So like that, that was like, I feel from my memory, the super auto pets backseating was a little bit, it was a, from what I remember, more positive. I'm sure there was still some weird people, right? You know? Um, okay. We're still getting screwed by this refresh stuff here. Nice. Got the refresh there. I'm going to get the wrong person here. Give me the bombs. Refresh? Nope. Dude, we're taking a lot of damage early on. At least that one guy's blinded. That one guy's blinded. Okay. Definitely gonna have to buy healing. This is just a normal combat too, that's what's sad. Splatorb's doing a lot of damage, though. Makes sense. I mean, it's level three. Okay. Um, I'm going to just heal. It's like I feel like I should take something. I'll take an assemble here. Starting up an assemble. Maybe go for that shop over there. We got one gold. One's next crab champions, uh, Wednesday. Normally Wednesday is when we play them, so we're definitely still planning on filming some crabby crab games stuff on Wednesday. Yeah, crab champions and peglin are my two two big series right now. So it's like every peglin will record, <laughs> every Wednesday we'll record two peglin videos. Every crab champ, oh, dude, I don't know why I talk the way I talk. Every Wednesday we'll have crab champions. Or on stream. Okay. Uh, we have sixty nine money. Funny number. Okay, I'm gonna aim the exact same way. It's gonna hit a bomb. Nope. So it was worth a shot. Come on. Need bombs. This map is so hard to get bombs. Honestly, we may die right here. We may die right here. Dude, it's just I'm like the higher crucibles are so frustrating when you can't get the um the the refreshes. Like getting refresh stock is so frustrating. Oh, <laughs> okay, we hit the refresh there. We didn't die yet. Heal. <sighs> Jeez. Um, I don't even know, man. Um, poison slime. I don't know. We haven't really done poison slime in a while. And because, yeah, last. Uh, who are we fighting? Okay. Let's just try the poison slime. We haven't really done a poison uh, slime thing in a <gasps> A while 
Like I I need I need things to help me right now, you know. Uh this guy, yeah. Yeah, this guy someone was just asking what this relic is. Yeah, unique orbs in your deck get plus 1 plus 2. So, really good. Um it seems really boring, but the implications of what it means is honestly like it makes it one of the most uh cool orbs because it allows you to really use some orbs that don't get shown or you don't normally see uh utilized a lot, so I really just want to guarantee that we hit a bomb. Oh, we should be able to hit another bomb. I don't want to get pelted by those projectiles. Nice. Okay. As long as we got one bomb, all I needed there. We, we need all the health we can get here. So we need to at least get 25 gold to buy a healing. I'd love to somehow have even more than that, but I don't think that's going to happen. I don't think that's going to happen. And so this, that poison for every poison that's out it oh summoning circle man i wish i could afford summoning circle i need okay summoning circle we gotta do it we gotta do it as much as i need healing summoning circle man okay let's try to get a little gold and still go to the left okay we got like two more gold okay okay decoy orb enemies don't get their first extra turn not gonna complain about that give me a good event good event that's ah uh, Actually, you know what? That's actually good for Summoning Circle. It makes Summoning Circle do less damage, but I think that's fine. Uh, we're using Summoning Circle for the multipleness of the other orbs. So, when an enemy hits you with melee, blind them. So, we're having a lot of blind stuff. So, the problem here is I need normal combat so I can heal. I need two normal combats so I can heal. We got Molten Gold, which normally I would be okay with, but I can't beat this boss 28 HP. So... Oh, okay, we did get one combat. Oh, guys. We're gonna get multiple... Wait, Summoning Circle just summons one copy of the next orb in your deck. I forgot <laughs> I forgot it's it's not very great uh, when you first use it. Now, it's good, like, yeah, if you had, like, a Restorb or something, you know. You can get multiple Restorbs. That's really good, but... Unfortunately, we don't have Restorb. I, I think this build ain't gonna... Uh, I don't have faith in this build. I don't have faith in this build. Well, that's okay. <laughs> uh, this is okay. I'm trying my hardest here. So it's like here. I can shoot one. I mean, so like, okay, now there's poison, so he's going to take 10 damage. Like, congratulations. Like, that's not... It. So now they're taking two da 20 damage. Uh, I don't know. I didn't think this poison slime was going to do much for me, but... You have to try... I think I'm gonna just try to dig out the bombs. But I think we're dead though. Uh, I wanna make that clear. I wanna make that clear. In fact, I think, yeah, we are dead. Oh, okay, we'll do one more. We'll do, uh, we'll do... One more. Why does my green screen keep getting worse? Oh, probably because it's getting dark out. Well, Crucible on. We are on Crucible 13 on Spinventor. So we're going to try one more time here. Uh, round guard's really good. We'll go Enhanced Gunpowder, though. So yeah, the first kind of successful build was a refresh build. And now we're trying to see what we can get here. I don't know. So we'll try one more time this video. Enhanced Gunpowder's not bad. I just that build didn't have it. There there was there was nothing I was ecstatic about on that build. Enhanced gunpowder I can actually get a little bit excited about, right? I can get a wee bit excited about it. Okay. Just trying to get gold. Okay, and so I think what happens is a lot of the times I focus early on on making sure I get a lot of gold and then I kind of just end up taking more damage than I really should. So I think that's something I probably could work on. Um, but I think getting gold early on is good. It's just like, if, yeah, if you don't have healing, taking eight damage every single combat isn't sustainable, you know? Um, okay, we're going to take rubber. Uh, let's, let's, let's get... Well, actually, what, what boss are we fighting here? Uh, slime boss. Okay, yeah. Rub orb is insanely good, consistent, just um, specific damage, um, especially on Spinventor. Um, do we take the obelisk here? 
Probably not, because we don't want too many duplicates. So I think we just force, get rid of a pebble here. We haven't done obelisk in forever, but I don't think this is the time. I haven't seen a bold orb in forever either. Um, in ever. Also, let me fix my green screen even more. Professional streamer, don't you worry. Okay. Let's find short fuse early and get all those chests. That would be nice. I always love that. The, like, pretty much guaranteed, yeah, when you have short fuse and enhanced gunpowder. It's so nice. Okay, so here, I'm just gonna try to get gold. What happened to all the bold orbs? Are they base peglin only now? Yeah, I have zero clue. I have no clue. I, I, I feel like I have not seen bold orb in forever. They are just on base peglin now? It is weird, because I thought the whole point of peglin was that he was supposed to have, like, the majority of other people's stuff. But I guess he has his own stuff as well. Alright, we have not played Peglin in months and months and months, like the default character. Because, yeah, I mean, we've already got him to Crucible 15, so I am very excited to go back to him eventually, you know. Ooh, Magnet. Magnet and Ekorb. Man, I want both of these. I want both of these so bad, but we already have Splatorb as a good single target. Let's take Ekorb, because we don't have any AoE. Um, Ekorb, especially on Spinventor, really nice. I feel like I've seen Boldorb on Baladin, or maybe Round Roll. I don't know. I know we could just look at the custom class thing. Um, if we really cared, but I don't. It's just too much effort. Okay. Yeah, Rub Orb, Rub Orb's kind of crazy, right? We've definitely learned to appreciate Rub Orb. Um, especially on Spinventor, that's what's so great is, oh dude, now this Echorb man, we would have taken a lot of damage here, I think normally, but now, see, and then because we have Spin, uh, Spinventor and Ginterality, right, we increase the damage just a little bit on that, oh, that was so good, that was sexy, that was sexy, right, even terrible isn't terrible, ha, <laughs> get it? Um, better than the, the Pebbles, right, Spinventor, because it's technically unique orb, there's only one of them. Uh, I was hoping for a little bit more money there. It's fine. Um, okay, so we're definitely going to take Ether Wheel because we don't have our refresh situation handled. Ether Wheel is a way to handle the situation. So this is actually a very promising start here. We're checking off some of our boxes really early on. Basalt Totem. Um, not great, whatever. We can still try. Nope, we were close. Um, maybe going for the shop here? We'll probably, yeah, probably go for the, I mean, yeah, no reason not to. So we'll make sure we don't spend any money here. Um, and yeah, Etherwheel, guarantee, it, Etherwheel's nice, right? Especially if you don't have your refresh stuff figured out. Guaranteed refresh at some point in time. Better than nothing, right? Because you guys have seen, we have lost run after run after run getting our refreshes stuck. It is brutal. So, really gonna try to get as much money here as I can. That was a good AoE, dude. Ekorb is gonna be nice. Spinventor doesn't have Boldor, but the other classes do. Gotcha. Squeeze out every single gold that we can here. Surprised we actually haven't gotten the bomb here. I think we don't really need it. At, at most, we'll take a Oh, there we go. Cool. Nice. Let's go. The kitties have decided to stop sleeping. Please want to say hello to Ramsey. What you doing, Ramsey? You just wake up from your nap. You just wake up from your nap. Look how sleepy he looks, so... You're so cute. You're so cute, buddy. Oh, I missed. I missed. I misty wisty. Let's get a little bit more gold here. Let's see if, if Ramsey will be my good luck charm. Oh, nope, he's trying to run away. He does not... He does not want to be my good luck charm. Okay. Um, oh, yeah. We said we were going to save all our money. 
for the shop. That's what we're going for. Uh, heal six when reloading. Honestly, yeah. I think we just try to have a small deck um, because yeah, that's probably pretty good. Pretty important here. Pretty important. Hey, I know it'll probably be delayed. Thanks, Mark, for the five bucks. Appreciate it. Got more of these uh, text-to-speech. Um, people people told me that the previously with all the sticker donations, right, where we were reading out what it was, and I was thinking it was AI. People were like, no, that's for people that are, like, blind or whatever. It's like an accessibility HTML thing. So this time we allegedly got a sticker of a pair character lying on the side, raising his arms while saying, how's it going? <laughs> It's going well. Appreciate it. We're hoping to get some more luck. Duplication station. I love duplication station. So that uh, hopefully will help our run here. If you could get any common relic or any level three common ore, but only one or the other, what would you go for? Is it at the beginning of the run? If it's at the beginning of the run, most of the time, just like a level level three restore. Just start off the game with a level three restore. Going to be crazy here. And at this point in time, I actually think I just want to upgrade what we have. So I'm going to lose four HP to upgrade, not the pebble, lose six HP, splat orb, lose eight HP for the rub orb. And then uh, one more time. No, 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 no more, no more, no more, no more, no more. No more. And honestly, I don't I don't even want to fight this elite. So we but we may be forced to. Okay, but we did just upgrade a lot of stuff here. There it is. I don't know why those are so late. <laughs> Appreciate it though. Ah, the echo was late. I think we still try, because if it hits this crit. Yes! Yes! 87 damage AoE on an echo. Oh, thank you, Spin Vintern Gentorality. Unfortunately, the enhanced gunpowder kind of messed that part up, but that's fine. Okay, we're hoping just not to take a lot of damage. Hopefully us upgrading a lot of our orbs helps out. We've already killed one. Hey, duplication station. Let's go. We've already killed the second. Let's go. Let's go. Hoping to hit this refresh. We didn't. Nice. That's why we have other wheel, right? I mean, we got lucky with it getting early on here, but we need, we need our refreshes to be solved even more. Oh yeah, rubber, rubber was a lot of damage. Duplication station's always good. That it is. That it is. Okay, refresh circle. Oh, but I need to heal. But we'll take refresh circle. I need that. Oh my gosh, okay. Uh, the, the knuckles where we're doing must circle. So I don't think, same, we're, do, we're getting more of these refresh builds, but I don't know if I have much health to. If we had cookie, it could actually be something decent here, but yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Hoping to get some bombs. There's one. There's one. That's big. That's a hard to get one, too. I think we should start immediately digging out one of the bombs. Well, maybe I shouldn't use the other wheel then, but whatever. Um, okay, actually, let's just try to get a crap ton of damage here and then echo orbit. Okay. Be a good echo orb here. Gonna keep trying to get that, uh... Ooh, nice. I love Duplication Station. It's so good. Okay, come on. Give me the bombs. Oh, yikes. Really didn't want to take any damage here. Wow, we took a lot. Oh, and now we have JoJo saying hi as well. You get two cat cameos in one. Hi, JoJo. What are you doing, buddy? What are you doing? What are you doing, JoJo? You guys wake up from your nap. You come to terrorize me. Hmm. I'm going to heal. If you come to terrorize me, Jojo. Is that what you've done? What, what are you doing, buddy? What are you doing? What are you doing? Here. You want to sit on my lap? Oh. Jojo. Jojo shot for me. Shot for me. Ooh. Oh, there, buddy. Just drop something. Jojo being crazy. Those cats are different sizes than when I saw them. <laughs> They've been getting big. Oh, okay, okay. He's got his foot on the, <laughs> the space bar. Jojo is playing the game now, not me. Jojo is playing the game, not me. Huh? 
Okay. Uh, money. We'll at least be able to heal one more time here. We might. I think we're gonna make it to castle. Um. Okay. So we're going to heal. And we don't have an assemble. That is an AOE assemble. But I feel like upgrading would be better, right? Yeah, let's just upgrade what we have. Let's go ahead and upgrade Rub Orb. We just need a crap ton of damage. Okay, so if you lose YouTube comments, can blame JoJo. <laughs> exactly. What are you doing, JoJo? What you doing? Okay. Oh, we were close to hitting that crit. What are you doing? Here, let me get this. I just put like a blanket on my lap so it's like easier for them to to sit. Here. There you go. I made you a little bed on my lap. Isn't that cool? Okay. I'm, I'm getting so distracted right now. Yo! 300 damage. That's what we need. That's what we needed. It didn't even refresh. At least we have other wheel coming up here. Okay, no way I hit the crit there. Nope. I don't know, man. I'm still getting a little bit scared. Duplication station on a crit, 60. Oh, man, dude. A little bit of healing there. I don't know, 52. Do we have enough damage here? Okay, Rub Orb. Rub Orb did a lot of damage last time. 90. Come on. 70, oh my god, 48. Okay, I think we're good. Yeah, dude. Wow, barely, barely making it to castle. Okay, we'll go ahead and take a Poltergeist and we'll heal. So we have a little bit more AOE. Um, as much as I would like to take Leaf the rest for later, we don't have Cookie. We do have um the the boob broccoli, but I don't think that's good enough. So we'll just take the Magnet. We haven't taken Magnet in a while. I feel like a lot of our runs we've been struggling because I take risks with some of the boss relics. And fighting the wall. Is the run cursed or blessed by the kitties? Uh, both. Both. Both, I tell you. Yeah, Rub Orb is doing a crap ton of damage, that's for sure. That is for sure. And, I mean, we have an uh, Ether Wheel and a Refresh Circle. Man, if we could just get Cookie. We would have so much healing. I definitely want Cookie. And it was nice to get those upgrades on some of the orbs, right, from that one event. Okay, so now we just need to upgrade things here, I think. Um, let's go ahead and upgrade. Probably... We'll do Poltergeist, because that's more consistent damage. And honestly, I'm going to take the safer route, just going to the left. I think I need a little bit more time to heal up a little bit, right? Upgrade some of our orbs and stuff like that. Okay, duplication station, so satisfying. So satisfying. Wish Poltergeist came a little bit later, but that's fine. Oh, whoa, Magnet there. Magnet did something quirky. Quirky perky. Dude, we could we could do something here this build. Echo Orb's actually gonna be good, especially with the crit. Oh, this actually does more damage non-crit because we have the broccoli. So yeah, unpretentious pendant, right? Obviously would be good. It was the time for leaf. I don't know. I feel like Magnet was definitely the safer play. If I had Cookie, we it would have been a different conversation, right? Shaggy for Halloween? No, the the. The, the Halloween outfit was, uh, was, was, it was a low effort Halloween outfit. It was Ken from the Barbie movie because I, I had already bought this hoodie. That's, that's, that's what the low effort, uh, I could, I could see Shaggy as, as well though. Okay. Well, I mean, we've got good AOE. We've got okay, decent refreshes. Magnet's helping out a lot, I think. So the build has potential. We just gotta hope. 
We keep figuring it out. Let's upgrade Poltergeist here again. Trying to really do the most we can with our money. Get a little bit more gold here. I'm still waiting for the cat made cooking stream. <laughs> yeah, that sub goal got abandoned a lot. Probably quite a while ago. I think it was, at least for now, uh, un unobtainable, unobtainable goal. Because you got to, you got to make that a high goal, right? We were so close to that one. Love your videos. Hey, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it for real. Okay, come on, give me the bomb. Give me, give me the free chest. Hey, we got it. Okay, every reload grants balance. We haven't gotten that in a while. So just more damage scaling. That's pretty good. Right, balance is good no matter whether we're doing crit or non-crit. Um, upgrade an orb. Let's go. Let's upgrade um, uh, Echo Orb. Right, upgrade all of our AoE here the most. Waiting for the stream where you beat getting over it twice. <laughs> You're going to be waiting for a long time. <sighs> oh. oh, boy. was obtained during the subathon, but you said it was not valid anymore. Yeah, because, yeah, before we do subathons, right, yeah, it's like, we don't really want to have all these other goals uh, overlapping and stuff, you know, because kind of defeats the purpose of the, the subathon, you know. Because the subathon itself is is the, the sub goal or the reward at that point. Um. Okay, so let's just keep, I don't, yeah, I think we just need to upgrade what we have, right? So upgrade the Ek Orb. Um, don't even feel like healing. I'm going to hold on to my money a little bit more. See if we can get a little bit of money here. We got one. Do you have anything against getting over it? No, I just, I never promised I would, one, even play that, and two, <laughs> play it twice in the same stream. So I just, I, I don't know where you're getting the, the, that specific idea that I'm going to do that. <laughs> Yeah, we got a we got a big old. Door chick, are you okay? Big old echo orb. Hey, the real Freds. Thanks for following. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Okay, good echo orb here. So just by default now, this is going to do 196 damage. Probably going to need to heal. Man, we need some healing relics or something. That's for sure. Um, okay, we will heal and then we'll upgrade. Uh, other wheel because we need our damage really high for the wall, right? And other wheel surprisingly a lot of damage there. Didn't really want to risk going for gold there. Want to make sure we get the navigation. Oh, okay, secret elite right here. That is interesting, actually. I think I can handle it. Especially it's a single target one. Think I can do it. Two thirty. So yeah, we are very soon, our non-crits are gonna do more than crits. Guaranteed refresh there, nice. Okay, he's already less than half health. So now this one, same crit damage and non-crit damage, doesn't matter to me if we hit it. I'd love to hit that refresh, but man, already did a lot of damage. Hopefully we kill with Rub Orb here. We should be able to. Come on, yeah, nice, already killed. Cool, cool. Okay, so that we are that's the assemble part that oh no, we didn't take assemble. Yeah, I don't need that. Um we're going to upgrade other wheel and then heal. Uh bombs apply blind. Yeah, we'll do that. And we'll go for two chests over a shop. Um if we had been saving money, that could have been okay, but um, I don't think we're gonna have much money. Create two gold whenever the board's refreshed. That's a lot. We're actually gonna end up with a lot of gold long term. We have actually a lot of refresh stuff here. Okay. So I'm glad that we, uh, just like the first build that made it to, what, did we make it to castle first? We did, and we died of the suicide bomb. That was this video, right? Yeah, that was a refresh build, so. Hopefully. We'll be able to get something going here. Just upped our damage a crap ton with the uh, duplication station being on the refresh circle. And yeah, using a terrible, not not bad. Would love unpretentious pendant, right? No chance we hit crits. I'll we'll go for uh okay, yeah, dude, other wheel, and then yeah, dude, Echo Orb is amazing, man. Even yeah, that was what, 200 damage? So guaranteed we're doing 200 to everybody. That's so good. Let's hopefully see if I could get 
I'm hoping we get 50 gold. Still. I think, yeah, we got 50 gold. Easily. Dude, 430-something damage to everybody. That's so good. Um, yeah, so we're not getting a shop, so let's just continue. We're gonna upgrade. Refresh circle. I don't need to heal anymore at this point in time. And here we can try to gather as much gold as possible. Got a decent amount. Your hair's the exact color as Shaggy's hair. <laughs> um, okay. Oh my god, I'm so dumb, dude. I'm so dumb. Okay, we can at least get a removal. I forgot that puts you to the other side. We just lost the chest. Um, but we can remove a level one pebble. Not the worst thing here. Not the worst thing. And now we're fighting wall. I think we can at least make it to caves here. Um, okay, let's just get a big other wheel. This time we probably want to crit. Big other wheel. Because then it's going to echo orb. Oh my god, dude. We're going to have a 2,000 damage echo orb. Wow, dude. It starts off with 1,600. Starts off casually with 1,600 damage. Let's go. Okay, 1,800 damage. It is begun. And try the roguelike folk hero. I've not heard of that. What is it? If you're in our Discord, you should throw that in on suggestions. Sometimes I forget. I get recommended so many games, so... Um, and there's a lot of roguelikes coming out now. Okay. Um, okay, we're gonna... Yeah, just build up these stats here. We're fine. I don't know why I'm stressing out here. What was that middle orb? Is it an orb that I have? Or is it an orb that I passed up? What are you asking about? Dude, we're doing a lot of damage here. Freaking six muscle already. Is there something strange you do that you refuse to do differently? Example, I refuse to wear pants unless it's like a formal event. Hmm. I don't know. I'm trying to think. I can't think off the top of my head. Uh, I, I, will, I will get back to you on that. I'll, I'll think. So we're going to discard here. Like, zoink, Scoob. They were on our... I, don't, I can't do... I can't do accents. Not a very good... I, I can do some voices when I don't have to mimic a voice. It's so hard for me to mimic voices. Also, yeah, all of those... Yeah, I forgot that we had, yeah, the Re-Philosopher's Stone. We're getting so much gold from that. We're getting so much gold from that. In the shop, with like a shadowy exclamation mark. Huh. I don't know. If I saw a picture of it, I could maybe tell you, but... Whenever I take pills, I drink water first, then put the pill in my mouth. Or multi-ball. Yeah, we do have a lot of gold now. Finally able to get everything upgraded here. Yeah, at this point in time, I'm going to start increasing my max HP. Um, there's the leaf, the rest for later. Still, oh man, dude. We would get so much gold, though. With Rift Philosopher's Stone. But I don't want to... <sighs> I don't want to throw because I take that. Um... We would have, you know what? Do I take it? Do I take it? Do I take it? That would be so much gold. No, I don't think we take. <sighs> Your deck is good enough for sealed conviction. That is true. Being forced to use these isn't the worst. You know what? Yeah, you've convinced me. Let's not throw taking the leaf. You've, you have, uh, you have convinced me. Okay, let's see if we can be Crucible 13 here. I believe. I believe that we can win. I believe that we can win. I believe that we can win. Yeah, plus two plus two is a huge, huge increase. Oh, 
was kind of pathetic. Okay, so we're guaranteed like 300 damage or something. Just hit the refresh as well. Oh yeah, I have no discards. Rip. Fuck the leaf. It's so satisfying when you make it work though. It's so satisfying when you can make it work. Also yeah, plus two plus two is like huge on refresh circle. Um, we have so much money. So let's upgrade Splat Orb as our final thing. And then we're going to, from this point on, save as much as we can um, for... I'm going to try to get as much gold as I can here. Yeah, it creates so much gold. Every time we refresh, we're adding two gold to the board. That's, that, that's a huge amount of gold. So if we can just go on a huge shopping spree right now, that would be kind of swell. Oh my god, dude. I'm able to get like all of this. Nice. Got a lot. So we need to just go left two more times here. We missed the elite, but... We're gonna have money, so that's fine. Oh yeah, can't discard. Come on, hopefully. No, I think we're gonna take a lot of damage here. Nope, never mind, we're fine. That crit helped us. Easy peasy. Um, okay, hold on to our money. Uh, actually, okay, yeah. I just wanna make sure we go to the left here. Okay, we need to go to the left one more time. Um, refresh moves after every shot, reduce self damage. Okay, I'm fine with most of these. I'm gonna go for the tactical treat. Yeah. Just make it a little bit better. Also, oh man, please let me go to the shop. Yes, okay, we can buy two relics here. Um, oh, ambidextrinary, that's huge. Or do we just, re actually, man, I a turtle could be good, but yeah, let's go ambidextrinary. And then we're going to remove, or I could eye a turtle. No, well, ambidextrinary and remove a pebble. Because yeah, now removing a pebble makes that other pebble actually worth a lot more. So we can discard if we need to. Um, and then I think I kind of want to stay left and hopefully go hard right after that. So I don't know. Okay. Oh Lord, <laughs> not the red bobs. Anything but the red bombs. This is how we've... Red bombs and suicide bombers have uh, been the uh, bane of our existence recently. So... Using a little bit of red bombs here. I actually need more of them. I need more red bombs. That's too many, too many, too many, too many, too many. Too many. Too many. Too many. Too many. There you go. There you go. We don't need to go crazy with it. We don't need to go crazy with it. Okay, that's enough. That's enough, game. Game. Game, that's enough. That's enough, game. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Dang, now we don't have a good Echo. Echo or whatever. Whatever. You can get some bombs. I took a lot of damage, man. These red bombs. I'm still taking a lot here now. Okay. I should be able to hit two damage and 74 damage without a bomb. Should be doable. Come on. No, no more. No more. I don't need red bombs. There you go. Okay. So obviously we need to heal. I might even increase my max HP and then heal. Yeah, I'm going to increase max HP and heal. See, so now basalt totems. Kind of nice. Oh, okay. Sap or sac relic would, uh, would scare the crap out of me right now. Would scare the crap out of me. So this is, we just gotta hit him a lot. Oh, rub orb will, uh, rub orb and duplication station help a lot. Hey, oh, I was hoping it would fall into the right spot there. Probably should do it there. Oh. Smaller, so it didn't matter as much. He does a lot of damage. This is the first time we've actually had him up in our face in a while. Man, dude, chill. Now I can actually discard, so I could use this. Yeah, refresh circle is probably huge here. Oh my god, man. Okay, he's dead. Ooh, summoning circle. Okay, we'll take summoning circle. And then uh, we'll upgrade summoning circle. And we're not going to fight the elite, or at least I'm going to attempt not to. Kind of wanted to, but we got a little bit lower there than I wanted. I'm happy with just taking the summoning circle. I think we can win 
if we just make it to the boss. Um, okay. Um, honestly, I don't even need to remove those. So I think I'm going to just, no, I upgrade. There's nothing I could upgrade here. Actually, yeah, we'll just upgrade whatever that. And would enhanced gunpowder work here? Let's try. Does it? And it doesn't. That's fine. I wanted to go to the right anyways here. And then we get strange brew. It's okay. And honestly, I'm okay going either way. So let's see if we can get a free. Nope. Oh, dude, we're getting close. I hope we can do this here. I hope, I hope, I hope. I'm not taking any of these. Screw you. Oh, let's go. That's huge. That's huge. Go fight an early boss. Go fight an early boss here for a uh, rare relic. Huge. Huge. Already done. 312 damage to him. Do a crap ton of damage here as well. Let's go. 238. We're going to take a little... Uh, I took, a honestly, a little bit more damage than I was wanting to, but that's okay. Bolt up guys here. Should kill? Yeah, we're good. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. It's like I want to save up money for the boss, but I honestly need to build... Oh, yeah, no. The or, uh, I meant for the shop, but we're, we don't actually get a shop. So I'm now at this point in time going to just increase max HP and then heal. <gasps> Never an enemy is defeated. Refresh the board. Yep. That's good. And then give me... Oh, that was... Oh, I got so little gold compared to what I could have got there. <laughs> um... Was this like, no, it was chest. Uh, Non-crit does a little bit more, which is nice. Can we get, come on, come on, one more, one more. Oh, we were so close to getting another free chest. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Guys, guys, we get a bunch of terror balls here. Actually ends up doing literally just enough damage. Well, I guess it was 500 when they have 500 uh, health, but. Okay, so Terra Balls, 6-6. Six, six. Yeah, Pebble, level 3, 9-11. A lot more. Okay, I think we can do it. I, I don't know. Boss fight. I mean, boss fights on these high Crucible levels uh, can still be extremely hard, so. No guarantees yet. I'm hoping I can just keep, you know, using Basalt Totem every time. Increase max HP, heal up. As long as I have 50 gold, which... Don't kill everyone. I think we kill everyone here. No, we're two away. Um, okay, well, at that point in time, we just heal. Healing's the more important part there. And let's see if we can get more gold. Okay, we have an elite and then a boss. Hopefully we don't take too much damage here. No guarantee. <laughs> Every time I guarantee, I throw. So I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna hold off on guaranteeing quite yet. As much as I want to. I'm not that confident. I'm not that confident. Um, okay. If only we had gotten Cookie at some point in time here. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and immediately... It's only 480. Uh, okay. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Okay, there we go. There we go. We're good. 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 And we can afford a uh, max HP increase and a heal. Okay, max HP heal. Let's do it. We have 116. That is the new, as much as I want mental mantle, I think the boots are the new thing that we still haven't seen. So we'll take it just so it shows up new. Okay, let's do this. One of them. Okay, let's do this here. Okay, let's do it. Okay, number one through three. Uh, three. Three, three, three. Crute. Kind of fell a little bit weird. And we can blind this guy. No, we can't. How did we blind him? I don't know how we blinded him. Oh, bombs. So they'll have a slight blind chance on him. Slight blind chance. Okay, hopefully this does a lot of damage, because then maybe summoning circle with three Ek Orbs be kind of crazy. So he's blind 10%. I don't think this is going to be that great. Though summoning circle is always great, so if anything, this just helps build up another Ek Orb. Kind of getting a little bit hurt, though, to be honest. 
It is kind of nice that bombs are blinding him. He's going to have a slightly decent blind chance, right? He's at 12% blind right now. Okay, we need to dig out this right side of the map here. I'm still scared, though. We only got 70 HP left here. Yeah, the boots just help uh, double your Belusion cap. We don't have any Belusion generation, so it effectively is nothing for us. I just took it to, like, kind of unlock it. Because it still says we haven't gotten it before. Man, I'm, I'm scared here, though. I don't know. I think we might lose, to be completely honest. Okay, he missed. Right, 13% chance. Blind chance. I just... Man. I don't know. I don't know why we're struggling here still. Oh, Lord, dude. We don't want crits. I just... Why, I feel like I haven't done nearly enough damage to him. Yeah, I think we lose, man. I think it's another loss. I mean, there's too many red bombs here, too. Like, I'll, like even if, if the blind works perfectly, I'm gonna kill myself on red bombs. It's over, dude. I How did... I thought we were gonna... Ugh, he missed. It's fine, but we hit a single red bomb, and I'm pretty sure we're dead. Right? Like, 99% sure that's the case. There it is. Oh! <laughs> Rippity dippity dip! At least we got the boots. Whatever. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know what happened there. I guess our scaling wasn't good enough. We didn't have any healing, uh, which uh, obviously uh, hurt us a lot, right? Hurt us a lot. So, uh, new bosses. Bosses are hard. That boss sucks in Crucible 12 Plus. Yeah, that's a hard boss. But hey, it was fun. We made it to caves twice, right? At least it's not, we're not having as hard of a time as we are on round roll. So I'm sure we will eventually get a win here on Spinventor. You know, next couple episodes, we'll be taking more cracks at it. Hopefully we did it, but we did get some fun, uh, quirky refresh builds for sure. So, um, you know, if you're watching after the fact on YouTube, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys subscribe, bring, uh, ring that bell. Like with the big boy YouTubers say to be notified, uh, when more Peglin videos come out. If there are some, they'll be on the screen right next to me. And if you guys are going to be grinding out some Peglin, on your own and I wish you guys luck and see you all next time.